But here's the thing. Uh, if folks didn't like this year's Blue Devils, they were just being haters. Because, uh, or they lived in Chapel Hill. That's possible <laughs> as well. Uh, because these guys were fun. They, they ran off 14 straight wins to start the season. Uh, but by tournament time, they were down to just eight scholarship players, uh, four freshmen, one senior. Coach K described this year's championship as the best moment of his coaching career. And with five career championships, second to only uh, the legendary John Wooden, uh, that's saying something. Uh, last season, Coach K became the first Division I men's college coach to win 1,000 games. And somehow he did it without ever saying a bad word to a referee. <laughs> Only what they deserve. <laughs> Only what they deserve, he said. That's what I say about <laughs> some of my opponents. <clears throat> this team also visited uh, Durham Elementary Schools for the Read with the Blue Devils campaign. Uh, Coach K co uh, authored uh, an op-ed on the importance of early childhood education. Uh, players volunteered as mentors at the Emily Krzyzewski Center which is named for the coach's mother and aims to break the cycle of poverty uh, through out-of-school programs that help young people reach college. So this is the kind of program that we hope uh, for at any institution of higher learning. Uh, they represent their university well on and off the court. Uh, and that's why uh, their fans uh, are so passionate. Uh, that's why sometimes there are going to be some haters. Uh, but uh, they deserve uh, every accolade. Uh, they've got a, a great leader uh, in Coach K, uh, and it's an outstanding university, an outstanding program, uh, and they deserve uh, our hearty congratulations. The, uh, uh, the cool thing about our group was that uh, they were fun. And even the energy that, when I walk into a room, I always like, is it a locker room that needs to be picked up or? Yeah, are you already picked up? And you guys are already up. And, but that's what these guys did for me and my staff the entire year. And uh, I just want to tell them publicly you know, that we love them. And uh, it was amazing. And thanks for sharing that year with me. And the guys coming back, if, if you could do that again, I wouldn't <laughs> Again, thank you for inviting us for uh, this very, very special day. And if Quinn and uh, Emil, you guys come down, if you guys would come in and present that. Yeah. Yeah.